I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios here at AWS reInvent, joined by some amazing folks from Chugai Pharmaceutical and Accenture. I want to in have them introduce themselves. We'll start with you, Daisuke Yokota. Hi, uh, thanks, Brian. Uh, I'm Yokota from Chugai Pharmaceutical based on Tokyo. And V? Hi, Brian. Uh, thank you for having us. Uh, my name is V Cruz. I have been with Accenture for more than 18 years. Amazing. And finally, Hi, Brian. Uh, I'm to Kei Toga. I'm come from uh, Central Japan. I'm leading a crowd consulting team in Japan. Amazing. It's great to have the three of you here with us today. Some exciting stories. I want to get right into it. We're going to start with you, Yokota-san. Tell us about some of the industry challenges, mm -hmm. the cloud infrastructure journey, and a little bit of how that leads into your growth strategy. OK, so uh, so I'm very excited to be here at uh, AWS Lee in Dan to hear, uh, learn about um, uh, uh, leaders from different industry, mm -hmm. how uh, they have been liberated the cloud technologies. And uh, I'm uh, very happy to hear today, just sit here today, but and, uh, I'm actually here today to share about uh, how we are liberating the cloud technology in my company, uh, Jugai Pharmaceutical. So um, let me introduce our uh, company, Jugai Pharmaceutical. Yeah, please. And uh, uh, Chugai is founded in 1925, mm -hmm. and uh, is a research-based company, a uh, pharmaceutical. You have uh, a drug discovery capability, uh, including uh, proprietary antibody uh, engineering technologies. And um, we are located in Tokyo, uh, Japan, and um, uh, we belong to Roche Group. And uh, but uh, we are allowed to. Uh, our own uh, research and mm -hmm. business in Japan. Our strength is uh, uh, drug discovery uh, by leveraging um, proprietary um, our antibody uh, discovery. And uh, our strength is uh, drug discovery. And um, uh, we fully uh, utilize uh, uh, AWS or yeah. a cloud technology in the entire uh, or pharmaceutical value chain mm -hmm. for from drug discovery to uh, clinical development and uh, to manufacturing and to yeah. sales. And for example, uh, in uh, drug discovery area, uh, we used uh, uh, AI and uh, molecular uh, simulation in large scale in AWS and um, propose a promising compound to thereby reduce the time uh, the, for drug discovery, yeah, yeah, required time. And uh, on the other hand, in the clinical development area, uh, we are building a data collection platform mm -hmm. to buy uh, using uh, like a digital biomarker. And uh, for our manufacturing area, uh, we use AWS for um, a digital plant. Yeah. For example, uh, we provide um, automatic um, assignment for workers, and uh, we use AWS for remote supporting too, using uh, AI. Mm -hmm. And last one is a um, uh, digital marketing area. Um, we used, uh, after we released the drug to the uh, world, uh, we use AWS as a customer interface between um, healthcare uh, professional and uh, our uh, two guys uh, medical representative. So to sum up, uh, we ut fully utilize uh, AWS service in all bar chain. It's interesting to hear you say that. What I took away from that is that you don't just use it for research, mm -hmm. you don't just use it for development, yeah. but you also use it in the customer journey and in sales, kind of in that third tier. I want to talk about the concept of Chugai's cloud infrastructure, and like everything, it has a three-letter acronym, CCI. Yeah. So tell us about CCI, the concept, and the goals. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, sure. So uh, before Chugai cloud infrastructure, um, we have been using uh, AWS uh, services uh, very much, so in fact, um, a significant And until now, our each IT and uh, the digital transformation project uh, had its uh, own uh, individual optimization and leading the problem like a long time, long lead time to deliver a server infrastructure and IT infrastructure and a varying level of security and uh, 
it, uh, there are a lot of uh, silo environment and right. uh, yeah, uh, IT operation. So in this context, um, we launched the uh, two guy cloud infrastructure. It's called the CCI, mm -hmm. uh, addressed to the these issue in last year. And um, the concept of CCI is to make a large and secure and well governed uh, big SIP uh, structure like um, uh, utilize and uh, multi cloud infrastructure. And we have a concept of putting a all value chain system and all application on the large scale SIP like this. How has that helped make things easier? Give me an example of where you did something an old way with silos, for example, and things were complicated and they were, they didn't talk to each other. Mm -hmm. And by putting all of this information and this automation and optimization in CCI, yep. in the cloud, how has that really helped? What has that done for Chugai Pharmaceutical? Uh, it's uh, good for uh, like agility mm. and uh, high governance. Yeah. yeah, that is a very uh, benefit for our CCI. Talk to me about, I, I'm always fascinated by these projects and it was a journey to get there. Mm -hmm. How did it start? Uh, how is it managed? Mm -hmm. And how is CCI meeting goals? Um, well, so this uh, towering uh, digital infrastructure uh, is a feat uh, built with a lot of uh, help and support. Mm -hmm. So our, our team from Accenture, uh, for instance, here with me today, right. has been supporting uh, like uh, implementation and operation of CCI. Let's talk about that partnership now that you brought it up. Mm -hmm. We have your representatives from Accenture, they've literally been by your side as they are now. Let's elaborate on that partnership between Chugai, uh, Accenture, AWS ProServe Japan. Let's talk about that for a minute. How, how is that going? Well, so Accenture and uh, you know the AWS Japan professional service uh, have uh, good uh, support to yeah. the yeah, Chugai infrastructure from our like, um, strategy phase and mm -hmm. implementation tech phase and uh, operation phase. I'm very good thanks to the uh, AWS Japan and uh, Accenture Japan. What about this partnership? Why Accenture? Um, well, so I would say that Accenture have a uh, high uh, capability uh, mm. regarding um, AWS uh, skill and uh, good uh, strategy of uh, cloud technologies. So it is a wide. I had a good uh, partnership with Accenture. Just added a bit about the uh, public seat. Yeah. Um, Chugai, Accenture, and uh, AWS Japan uh, started uh, working together two years ago from our uh, strategy mm -hmm. new operations doing uh, support and enhancements. And we call invent uh, to get uh, the best uh, worth of Chugai and Accenture. Um, the case in point, we continuously re-invent our preview to sustain the gold uh, standard services and uh, bring the best uh, variable uh, in fact uh, to the uh, true best client. Fantastic, and it sounds like you're doing great work. Uh, what's next, Yokota-san? Uh, what's next in this partnership? How do you evolve from here? Um, well, so actually, um, we are currently uh, promoting to use uh, of uh, generative AI, mm -hmm. and um, uh, Ada's backlog is uh, currently uh, testing to um, to be able to um, embrace the lo la large language model platform right. for uh, provide to provide a uh, healthcare service to the our patient. Mm -hmm. And uh, regarding the partnership with Accenture, uh, I think uh, I'm very excited to see how our partnership will uh, evolve. So um, as you know, uh, over the last 10 years, uh, the cloud technology uh, has uh, advanced uh, with tremendous weight. So I think uh, it's exactly that uh, it is very important to keep uh, the relationship with organizers like Accenture to make it their business to uh, anticipate and leverage change. B, would you agree? Yeah, I completely agree with you, Dr. Sand. Um, so, no, you're right. If there's something I am most proud of, 
in this partnership is uh, the commitment of both AAA and the center to put innovation at the center of everything we do. Huh? So we, in between AAA and Accenture partnership, uh, we we truly rely on our collective uh, resources. Yeah, right. We share knowledge mm -hmm. and we collaborate <laughs> in building our um, our playbooks. Yeah. Co, co innovation and and ha and having this partnership. There is actually no blueprint, right? But we certainly have done the factors to a very good life, right, Jakarta San? That's great, and it, it kind of, I mean, I can tell just watching here, you you get along great and you really work together, uh, the team works together to solve problems and to make things easier for Chugai Pharmaceutical. We're about out of time, but Dakota san I would love for you to just kind of wrap it up for us. Mm -hmm. uh, what are we looking forward to? What's next? Uh, tell us about this partnership. Um, well, uh, so with that, uh, thanks. Thank you for having a good opportunity to uh, share about uh, our business and mm -hmm. um, to the cloud infrastructure. And uh, I want to share that again. Uh, so our uh, two guys core business is drug discovery. Right. And uh, we fully utilize uh, AWS to for our body sham. And uh, we aim to uh, make uh, like um, digital innovative healthcare service yeah. such as a personal healthcare toward the 2030. And I'm, I'm excited to hear this development. It's a global issue. It's something that everyone is concerned about and be able to leverage the power of AWS Cloud in a pharmaceutical environment to better the world in general. Absolutely incredible work, fantastic. Thank you so much. Uh, Dakota San, V, and Kai Toga, thank you so much for joining us. I'm Brian Westbrook, GeekWire Studios. Mm -hmm.